Yo, what's going on, you guys? Your boy Pony Montana. Blah 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 blah. I'm not here for a long video. This is an announcement video. And it you guys you guys read the title. If you clicked on this, you guys read the title. We're just simply talking about it for a quick second, and I'm gonna go over the uh the article that has been circulating throughout the community. Uh but yeah, it is it's a uh, it's somewhat official. PlayStation remains and will stay and remain the champion of Madden gaming. Um, the reason why I say that is because crossplay has been announced on Madden 24. Um, EA hasn't officially released a statement yet on this. I do want to note that. But the article that I'm going to read to you guys uh, today is going to kind of touch base on as to, as to why we know f kind of for a fact that crossplay is actually going to be coming into madden and we're going to talk about what that means and what could potentially be going on in the future when it comes to you know the mcs and whatever the case may be now if you guys are new subscribe yada 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 let's get to the article because it's definitely one that uh that needs to be read and needs to be known by a majority of you guys as well just like myself uh ea sports is finally adding long-awaited feature to madden 24 I, I like you know what i'm gonna probably name my title that i'm it's probably gonna be like ea finally did it um but let's just read the entire article for you guys in a groundbreaking move ea sports has finally responded to the demands of fans and announced the inclusion of a long-awaited feature blah 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 According to according to report from Sports Gamer Online, multiple sources confirm that crossplay will be introduced, allowing gamers to compete against each other across different platforms. Sports Gamers Online, a reputable uh, gaming news outlet, revealed that a significant change has occurred in the way Madden 24 is being developed. The game's patch data branches have been restructured with a separation. And this is where, to me, I was like, definitely, there's no way. Uh, but the game's patch data branches have been restructured with a separation between the current and next gen consoles. So instead of having, uh, so instead of having the, the game's patch data, the branches branching off between different, you know, Xbox, Xbox one, PlayStation, PlayStation five, uh, then PC with the, with the, uh, previous gen consoles, they're. Now it's Switch where PC is being patched with the other consoles as well. So it, it's been put into two separate tiers instead of five different tiers to where Xbox, PlayStation, and all, all that stuff ends up being different. Because when there was a bug on, on Xbox, that same bug wasn't on PlayStation and, and vice versa. Now everything is going to be going through the same thing, and I think that's kind of huge uh this means that updates including content additions and roster changes will now be divided into two branches this is literally what i just said uh one for the playstation xbox series x and pc and another for previous gen consoles the implementation of cross-platform signifies a major shift of the madden franchise which is lagged behind other ea sports title and i still don't understand why they why they've taken this long to do it honestly but finally madden fans will have the opportunity to compete against friends and rivals regardless of the platform they are playing on creating more inclusive and interconnected gaming experience uh blah 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 dissatisfaction to blah, blah blah i'll leave this uh i'll leave this whole article in a link down below so you guys can see it for yourselves uh when announcing the closed beta for madden 24 the company also revealed plans to introduce new features and enhancements to franchise blah 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 so this for the rest of this with the addition of crossplay and the promised improvements madden 24 is shaping up to be a transformative entry in the long-running football video game series so that's pretty much it for crossplay uh sh first first things first shout out to ea for actually talking or ea is not even the one that's talking about it it's it's these people that know how to like finesse and get into the 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 nooks and crannies of like data when it comes to i don't know people are very very smart but what this means um auction house is uh, questions that are, have to be brought up auction house i don't know how fifa works i don't know how nhl works i don't know if the auction houses are all tied into the same thing i do know that fifa prices on certain cards are extremely high um so will that translate over to madden as well um tournaments how are the tournaments going to play out we don't know there's so many questions to be asked when it comes when it comes to this and uh it it would be nice to 
for EA themselves to announce it because a little bit of transparency when it comes to stuff like this so we can get prepared for that because some people might be trying to get xboxes uh or playstations just to play with their friends that they wanted to play with last year and they might not be they that that might not be the case this year you might not need to do that so in my opinion i feel like they need to announce this a little bit sooner um instead of having other people kind of dive into their you know their data and stuff like that to actually make it so that they uh to actually make it so that like they're the ones that are putting it out so people aren't confused about what is going on with madden 24 especially with the beta coming out now when, when the beta comes out it might be dropped right then and there but there are just so many questions that we need answered when it comes to uh when it comes to this specifically because playstation like i've argued for years that playstation has the better madden gamers and now that's it there's no there's no more argument there's just literally it's just a big pool of the best players in the world and that's exactly what we're gonna get so if you guys are on xbox and you guys have always wanted to play your boy we could we could we can now we we can now run it and actually play each other if this ends up being true but the fact that it's being announced and the fact that there is leaked data is absolutely huge what questions do you guys have i don't know Leave it down in the comment section so I could, you know, we, we can maybe we, we, we can maybe break down what actually ends up coming out. But to me, auction house, um, the tournaments and how again, this leads to the auction house as well. But like how how much how much are prices going to change because of the influx of players, you know, on one server on one in one auction house, if those auction houses are on the same, how does that affect coin sellers? Does it make them more money? You know, what is EA going to do to combat that? You know, there's so many different questions that need to be asked and so many different questions that need to be answered um, that at, who knows? EA, EA might be onto something. Well, it's not even that EA is onto something, but it definitely we have been needing this for a long time now. And the fact that it's taken this long while the other games have already implemented that into their into their game is low key kind of trash. But I'm glad that it's finally here. Let, let, let's just say that I'm glad that it's finally here. Um, I just don't I just hope that for PC players, uh, if there is like a little cross platform kind of situation with PC players, when it comes to the tournaments, they can't sit there and, and you know, config these, uh, you know, their little macros and their buttons to sit there and set up their defense for, you know, right side bunch, left side bunch, uh, uh, right side trips, left side trips, all these kind of formations at the at the press of a button. That'll be a little bit frustrating to deal with because obviously on on controller you're sitting there doing it yourself. You know you're you gotta you gotta have your sticks going crazy. But there's a, there's there's a lot of concerns. But I'm extremely happy that this is finally going to be put into the game. So let me know your thoughts. Uh, comment down below. Let me know what if you guys have any questions because I'll be making another video on this as well. Um, and as soon as it's confirmed, like by EA officially, then we'll make another video talking about it. As soon as the beta comes out. Let me know what you guys want on it, uh, want out of it. You know we're gonna, you know we're gonna come out with the with the blitzes, the heat, the coverage plays, all that stuff. So leave it down in the comment section below, and I will see y'all in the next video, man. As always, two fingers, deuces, and peace out, you guys.